All right, hi guys, this is Lear here, and today we are going to do a dialogue bridge tone, and we're gonna do it with animate weapon, because um, I'm not really sure uh, how the the uh, flame sentinels are gonna uh, fare, and I don't feel like looking for blade for specters. Uh, also, the breach itself is you know kind of tough and tanky so yeah um, I'm running with the melee splash instead of the void manipulation for my animate weapon because uh, I don't want to recolor my chest a whole lot anymore and since I'm using blade fort expectors for boss uh, killing and stuff um, I can just switch this setup around a lot easier than I would otherwise be able to so yeah let's just jump right into it and we have a couple of weapons to start with most of them are really shit to the rest of passion because why not, you know? Uh, I mean, chances for animated weapons to get that frenzy charge is quite low, so they get some free, uh, free yeah, extra damage, I guess. Um, so yeah, let's just hope that this is going to work because these breaches are really expensive and I don't really want to rip uh, any of them, to be honest. Uh, but the clear speed should be good enough uh, with the six link animate weapon, to be honest. Alright, let's kill this rare. They teleport. That's kind of annoying, the fact that they teleport. That makes life quite hard, to be honest. There's a rare here. Let's make sure we actually kill them, of course. Hello? Alright, cool. Looks like there's a lot of RNG in this uh, breach because of those rares. Let's pop our Vile Haze. There's two rares right here, I think. Uh... I think I got both of them, so let's continue on. Alright, there's rares here. Come on, weapons. Faster, please. Let's make sure we don't die. And as you can see, the timer is going up, so the clear speed is actually quite well on the six link animate with the flame sentinels to support. And of course, the zombies, etc. etc. Um, possibly you'd be fine with the 4-link animate weapon setup and the blade fort expectors because the damage is quite there, it's mainly the AI that's uh, annoying of course, so... Uh, looks like we're getting a lot of XP in this zone to 200% experience, that's a lot, to be honest. And a lot of loot, I think. I think it was, if it wasn't for these breaches to be extremely expensive, you'd be able to farm these quite consistently, right? Because I'm already getting like 17k uh, experience in this zone. Maybe it could be worth it in the hardcore uh, to do that. Timer is already up to uh, 39 seconds and we actually uh, finished the timer there. So looks like we're gonna finish this breach, actually. That's uh, quite nice. Oh shit, strength. There's even a good amount of map drops in here too. Already, like, that's not bad. Let's see. So that's 200% increased experience gain for tier 80. That's pretty mental, to be honest. Alright, so here we go. Chayula is going to do his Cyclone soon. And, oh, nice. We got a blessing of Chayula. So that could sustain our... Uh, thingies if we really want to. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys next